Here is how to create your first website online without writing any single line of code. Hello guys, you're welcome to another brand new tutorial and today I want to show you how you can create your own website without writing any single line of code. If you have been dreaming of creating your website or you just thought of paying people to create your website or you want to get into the market of creating website for people, this is the right video for you. So to be able to create your own website without writing any line of code, we're going to talk about six main steps step one is for you to get yourself a hosting and a domain name a hosting is simply a house where your website sits and the domain name is just the name given to your website such as codewithquest.com secondly you need to install whatever content management system you want to use to build your website now building websites without writing code will always to enable you to use a one thing maybe or many depending on the type of research in which you do and the type of information you get i would always recommend going along with content management systems an example of a content management system i highly do recommend is wordpress so wordpress is a content management system that allows you to build manage and create websites without even understanding how their code based systems actually work and secondly for you to be able to create your own website you just need to choose whatever content management system you want to use throughout your design and then now you install it in your hosting service provider third on the list choosing a theme now there are multiple themes outside here that you can use and within the wordpress community you have many themes that have been built by many people who are into wordpress web development so you can actually choose from thousands of free themes that are available or paid themes of which you can pay to get standard templates or there are even free themes that can give you standard templates that you can just install and kind of pull into your website and just kind of swap the content with ease now Fourth on the list is creating pages. Now, for you to be able to have your website working keenly and properly, you have to create pages. So pages are just like what users see, for instance, your homepage, about page, and contacts page. To an extent, depending on the type of website you're working on, you can add a blogs page where this is where dynamic content rendering comes in, which we'll be talking about in some of our upcoming tutorials. So don't forget to subscribe to get this content when it is released now creating pages and blogs will, will enable whatever visitor that visits your website to kind of be engaging to have so much variety of content to see so many things to do with respect to what you need and last on the list for you to be able to create a good website that looks good and perfect with so much functionality you have to add or install plugins in your website you don't just go ahead installing any kind of plugin a plugin is simply just like an application that you install on your website to improve or add an additional functionality to the one you already have okay so unlike you install apps on your smartphone you can install applications also on your website to improve on its performance or functionality now there are many types of plugins that you can install on your website so depending on whatever functionality you want your website to kind of perform you just have to do more research on that and understand what type of plugin to install so with these six basic steps you can create your own website from beginning to the end without any problem or writing any single line of code so first on the list as we said you need to get yourself a hosting and a domain name Hosting and a domain name is just where your website sits and the name given to your website. Second on the list is choosing a content management system and installing that content management system onto your domain name. And most hosting service providers already give a one-click installation to installing content management systems such as WordPress, very fast and easy. Ford was choosing a theme and we said the WordPress community have multiple themes that you can choose from and install to create your website with ease creating pages and blogs will improve your user experience on your website such that whatever visitors you have on your website will have a variety of content a variety of pages to go through to see more information about your website and lastly we said you should install plugins depending on whatever functionality you are looking to add to your website with all overall building a website 
with a content management system is a straightforward process that requires no coding skills and the most important thing is to choose the right content management system that suits you i always advise most people to go in for wordpress because i for one i work with wordpress i create videos on this channel around wordpress if you wish to see more of creating websites in wordpress don't forget to subscribe to this channel and if you just want to blow up your mind by creating your own website i created these four tutorials that will enable you to create your own website without any problem so you can watch this card over here for more of such details sign up for my email list or you can join my discord community where you have many designers that can showcase their works with you and also you showcase your works with them and gain feedback from whatever works you have done with no further ado see you in our next episode of code with chris